But I could use my powers to help you fight. Good, because now that you made Tennyson blow his only chance of an ancient Galvin power-up, we're gonna need your help. And more. Get back to Bellwood fast and round up all the plumber's helpers you can find to defend the Earth. This is not a drill. How am I supposed to get there? Gwen? I can't do it just any old time we need to teleport somewhere. It takes too much out of me. But this is an emergency. Maven Avery. What are you trying to say? Rain it in, Romeo. That's a little harsh. <laughs> he almost lost his lips. Yeah, he's gonna lose more than that if he ever tries that move again. Wow, somebody's jealous. Of Cooper? <sighs> Give it a rest, guys. Greetings, uh, wondrous, ancient Galvin. Welcome to our Earth. Uh, I don't think they're alive, then. They're just holograms. Maybe. No way to tell. Huh? Oh. <gasps> they're trying to take the Ultimatrix. Don't give it to them, Ben! <clears throat> Yes, I destroyed one of the pieces of your device to save my friend. You don't have to rub it in. Now I know where Azimuth gets it from. Hmm. You really think the ancient Galvin came all the way here just to give you a hard time? Azimuth does. No. Azimuth only shows up when it's something very important. And to give Ben a hard time. You think the ancient Galvin were trying to tell me something important? Bingo. But if you're still missing a piece, what good is it going to do you to find the rest of them? You want to argue with the ancient Galvin? Come on. Anti-air defenses in the area are too strong to drop you off close to the base. Looks like you're gonna have to find another way in. These guys got nothing. doesn't have enough power. Use amp...
What you got, Ben?
Chill! <laughs> Warning. Warhead temperature unstable. Ignition chamber deactivated. Launch sequence 
still active. Ignition chamber deactivated. seriously think they actually oh wait these guys can't seriously think they actually oh wait these guys can't seriously think they actually oh wait these guys can't seriously think they actually oh wait these guys can't seriously think they actually oh wait these guys can't seriously think they actually oh wait these guys can't seriously think they actually oh wait these guys can't seriously think they actually oh wait these guys can't seriously think they actually stand a chance But I destroyed you guys. Checked our past encounters, many of which have ended in our untimely demise. You may also recall that we are what you call clones. Oh, right. How many of there are you anyway? I are you a clone too? Let me do the talking, Boyd. Not again. <laughs> How 
I'm a gonna get you. <laughs> you get away from there now! <laughs> Ride and conquer! I'm a gonna get you! You get away from there now! from there now. I'm gonna get you!
Good thing the artifact doesn't seem to enhance brain power. This is Will Harang with a Will Harang Nation special report. Our reliable but anonymous source has once again provided us with stunning evidence of that vigilante vandal, Ben Tennyson, continuing his swath of destruction all over the world. But that's not the worst of it, concerned citizens. Ben Tennyson has brought about the apocalypse. That's right, the end of the world is nigh. I tried to warn you people about how dangerous Ben Tennyson is, but no! Now maybe you'll listen to me. Buy my book. Ben Ten, Threat or Menace, you decide. I just know it's gotta be Jimmy posting battle footage of me on his website that's feeding all these clips to Will Harang. He wouldn't do that again, would he? Not after last time. Maybe not on purpose, but he's just a dumb kid, right? He doesn't know any better. How old is he, like 10? Hey, when I was 10, I was saving the world. Did you walk to school uphill both ways, too? It has to be Jimmy. Who else could it possibly be? This is a message for Ben Tennyson. Scython! That guy's still around? Surrender the POTUS Altiari now, and the Earth may be spared the wrath of the mightiest being in the galaxy. Destroyer of worlds. The master of disaster! Yeah, right. Like that's gonna happen. I thought Asma said only Galvin knew about the existence of the Potus Altiari. Chalk up one thing the Galvin were wrong about. My master approaches. All tremble. Especially you, Ben Tennyson. Or you shall be the first to fall.